The tail light blasted into smithereens, a hole through the sun visor and glass littering the road. It's not evidence of a car crash, but debris left behind after a car was bombed in Sacramento's Oak Park neighborhood. I don't know if you ever heard like a propane tank like explode, like just something like that. Neighbor Octavio Hurtado said he felt a slight rattle after hearing the boom Friday night at 20th Avenue and 32nd Street. Sacramento police investigating not one but two similar explosions in a week. Another car was bombed just a few blocks away on 34th Street last Sunday. Investigators have determined homemade explosives were detonated inside the empty cars. That's just the only scary part. You know, someone's really knowledgeable to be making something like that. Neighbors say the car that was bombed here was abandoned for about a week before it was hit, stripped of its parts and its windows open, similar to this one. They're worried it could happen again. Neighbors we spoke to off camera say the city has been slow to act on their reports of dumped vehicles. They say this one, a white and graffitied Volkswagen, has been on the street for about a month. Neighbors say it's not only an eyesore, but the blight is attracting crime and creating hazards for residents. According to the city of Sacramento, Sacramento's website, the car's condition would allow the city to immediately tow the car without notifying the owner. Now, coupled with multiple reports of explosives going off in cars, neighbors are on edge as police have not tracked down whoever is responsible. One of two things, either they like doing that or they're trying to cause some harm to something or they're planning something. No one was hurt in the explosions. Police are asking neighbors to be vigilant and to lock their car doors. If you have any information that could help in the investigation, you can submit anonymous tips to the Sacramento Valley Crime Stoppers hotline.